bros. Check this out, folks. This hive decided to supersede its queen. She just wasn't doing as well. So I've been letting them rear a queen. And if you can see in the air, they're flying everywhere right now. I'm hoping what this is is a mating flight. I wouldn't expect it to necessarily swarm exactly, but I guess we'll see what happens. If we get down close, you can see they're kind of fighting to get back in as well. So, oh, I think I just saw the queen crawl in, to be honest. I can't tell. There's one like right there. Yep, right there. Right there. Right there. Yep, there she is. I think she's getting ready to fly off. We'll see what happens. There she goes. They're still flying around. But I've been banging on a metal trash lid to mimic lightning. And what that does is uh, tricks the bees into thinking a storm is coming. And it usually brings them down because at first they wanted to go into the top of that tree. <laughs> but I think what I saw was possibly a mating flight, which that's kind of what I was hoping for, you know, with me letting them rear their own queen. And you can tell how they're hovering right in front of the hive and they're facing the hive. And you don't see bees pouring out anymore. So I'm assuming at this point that yes, that was a mating flight and that they're coming back. Pretty cool. Love it. <laughs> oh. I love watching the bees fly. So cool. I guess it's safe to say that they've come back. <laughs> oh boy. Not so many bees in the, in the sky anymore. Oh, I just love watching this stuff. Oh, I got uh, one little kiss on the lip. I didn't feel too good. <laughs> I'm gonna have a fat lip for a couple days. But, man oh man, nature at its finest. All right, well, I'll uh, keep you updated on this one, but I'm pretty sure that I've got a mated queen and uh, hopefully a healthy hive.